Hello, Nurse Tim here with Nurse Think. It's time for questions for students. Today we're going to talk about adolescence and diabetes. So time to go to clinical. Here we are. Remember, read the stem twice. A nurse case manager meets with a teen client with type 1 diabetes who has a recent A1C of 8%. The client reports smoking two to three packs of cig uh, two to three cigarettes per day, denies using alcohol, and states, "I hate having diabetes. I just want to be like my friends." Which referral will meet this patient's immediate needs? Number one, a smoking cessation group for adolescents. Number two, a support group for adolescents with diabetes. Number three, an education session about insulin aimed at adolescents, and number four counseling family counseling so think about this go ahead and pause the video write down your answer write down your answer all right here we go if you got option number two you are correct and as we think about the options here when we look at what's going on you have to remember top three concerns top three needs and most of the time on, on, your, on your exams that you're going to take next week in class, on your NCLEX, most of the time it's going to be what does the person, the patient, say is a priority. And if you read the statement from the patient, okay, the patient says, I hate having diabetes. I just want to be like my friends. So, so yes, we're worried about the smoking. Yes, we're worried about are they treating, are they uh, managing their, their disease, their medication, their insulin? correctly yes we're wondering how it's going with the family as a whole but they said they said they hate having diabetes they want to be like their friends so let's go right to the heart of that and then out of that will come the opportunity to work with the adolescent on these other areas and these other issues um, if you will so all that to all that to say when you walk into a patient's room sometimes the best thing you can do is say Susie, Bobby, Fred, whatever the person's name is, what are your three priorities? That oftentimes is going to help them. Okay, a few reminders. Save time studying. Write a test question. You, a student, a nursing student. Yes, even if you're in the first semester, write a test question, share it with a friend. When you write a test question, you're actually taking part in an activity that research has shown that will help you get better grades. Write an S bar about a practice test question. Maybe you, maybe you didn't didn't do well on this question that you just saw. Write an S bar about it. Remember situation, background, assessment, and recommendation. And then always complete a nurse think notes on a test question that you got wrong. So as you're doing your practice testing, your practice quizzing, remember 20 quiz questions a day. Take it as a real quiz. Any question you got wrong, go back and study. Did you do thin thinking correctly? And then pick a couple of them uh, and complete a nurse think notes. Hey, I'm Nurse Tim, and I hope that you'll make it a great day. Thanks for stopping by nursethink.com. Bye for now.